from the ship. Survivor? Grossa, not much time. Who did this? Mongols? No. A rival band. Traitors. Yamaneko and his crew made a deal with the Mongols. The Mongols armed them with Wacha. Who are these raiders? Where can I find them? Uh, ask Sugi. She, she can help the village to the south. Red Casa had won her. They're coming. Uh. I hear the watchers. Run! This ever end. You again. I did not expect to find you on the beach. Did you know you need metal to build a house? I did not. I'm left poking around shipwrecks. Only place I can think to look. On Iki, anyway. But I envy these ships. The shipwrecks? They may be broken. 
Do you still have a sense of what they were? Everything of my family's. My father's trowel, my grandmother's hairpin, burned with the house. That's why I hope to build a new one. A house or a family? I should get back to searching these husks for metal. Or I will have neither. Let me save you some time. How can I accept this? You will have built my house for me. That I leave to you. I've seen homes burn. You would honor me if you accepted this donation. Then I have no choice but to accept. I'm building my house in a grassy clearing west of Fort Sakai. One day I will welcome you there. And let it be soon. Let it be soon. Must be the village. Hmm. I should ask around. Someone must know this Sugi with the red kasa hat. alone. It's not closing. <laughs> A lot of smoke. What happened here? Hundreds of flaming arrows shot from a ship in the bay. I know the vessel. Raiders, armed with Mongol weapons. I'm seeking someone who could help stop them. Sugi, where's the red Kasa hat? Don't know her. Are you lost? No. I'm searching for a woman. In a red kasa hat. Sugi. Been a man and woman living next door. His name's Sampe. Didn't catch us. Thank you. Locked. 
still warm. Someone is living here. You're looking for me? Why? I mean you no harm, Sugi. My name is Jin. I was sent to warn you. The vessel that fired on your village belongs to someone named Yamaneko. I need your help to stop them. They know I'm here. That means... Should we leave? Draw them away? No! No! We don't know anything! It's too late. Pack our things. Be ready to go when I return. Come with me, Jin. Come back to me. I'll avoid unnecessary risk. It's the first time for everything, I suppose. Sugi! Yamaneko sends his regards. Sebe! You always were his lapdog. <laughs> How do you like our new allies? Soon, we'll be the most powerful crew on this island. Kill them all! <laughs> 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 Yamaneko's crew are careful, well armed, only dock at a specific time and location. I take it you've met. I was his first mate, kept him from indulging his worst tendencies, for a time. When I met Sampe, I didn't want to be that person anymore. But you don't just leave Yamaneko. Tell me where his ship docks. I'll handle them. We work together, or not at all. <laughs> just remember that goes both ways. You're good with a blade. I have an idea we might be able to pull off. But I need to scout around first. Track down an old contact. There's an abandoned fishing village to the west. I'll meet you there. Good luck. Hmm. <laughs> you too.
Ching Haru. Yes, I'm Friend! Welcome! Like, here you are, this whole journey, and I never asked your name. I am Imotaro, and you are Jin Sakai, who freed us from the eagle. Like building this house, I figured it out on my own. If it's not too bold for me to say, you should be as proud as I am. You built this house too, there. Supporting the roof, that beam came from you. You can't see the hides, but they are there, beneath the thatch. And that corner there, that stays standing because of the metal you found. Believe me, I tried without. It set me back a week. You once told me you never built anything. Now you can say you have. And with this house, I can build a new family, like the one I never had. Thank you. When I saw a home burn, it was here on Iki. I did nothing then. This house won't make up for it, but it's a start. Have you seen him? The ghost of Iki? The ghost of what? The Samurai Phantom hunting bandits. Tall as a tree. Eyes of fire. People camped by Kimono Trail saw him just last night. If he's that impressive, I'd like to meet him. Let's go, Kag. Just 
Ghost of Iki, they call him. I'll take him over a dozen samurai any day. will help us. I hear he killed a thousand Mongols with that old Shimura bastard slung over his shoulder. <clears throat> yes? Those stories, they're not entirely true. Of course they are. You must have heard some good ones about the ghost. He snapped the Mongol Khan like a piece of driftwood. Sounds like him, all right. If you want to help his fight, the ghost of Iki is asking for donations. We leave our offerings at his camp. Northeast of where Kidafure village used to stand. If you're taking food, he likes his sake filtered and his millet washed. I'm sure he does. I hope the ghost hears our prayers. Hearing's one thing. Let's hope he answers them. been impersonating me. Must be the ghost camp.
still warm. Drank every drop. He was here, maybe watching something. I should wait, see if he comes back. Movement near the cap. Bandits. You must be the ghost. Are you stealing sake? Thief and Samurai. Don't hit those. Where are you running off to? Better catch up. Time to meet. See if you left a trail. Tracks. <laughs> Clumsy. Enough. I'm looking for the ghost. You and half the island. But we found him first. This little rat shit owes us a fortune. He owes me more. One day, boy. Then we start snipping off toes. So you're the hero everyone's talking about. Oh, oh, oh no. I, I'm not the ghost. But I do work for him. There we were, fighting to save Iki Island, when those dead fox bandits attacked us, took the ghost prisoner. <sighs> Where do they take him? Their camp, just west of here. I've got one day to pay them back. No, stay out of trouble. I will find your master. I have some questions for the ghost of Iki.
thought it was something. Stop wasting my time. to be the ghost. A respectful tribute. <laughs> respectful? I should have known you were behind this. I'm sorry, Lord Sakai. With Mongols everywhere, I, I couldn't take it anymore. Then I heard this icky smuggler was prepping a one-way trip to the mainland. I had to get out! And you didn't say goodbye. You're always so busy! If you were so eager to escape, how did you end up like this? I got caught sneaking aboard the smuggler's ship. When word got out that I was stranded on Iki, some very bad locals hunted me down. Tried to rob me! Did you rob them first? Skimmed profits and Sawasaki never hurt anybody! So you're the most hated man on Iki. Half the island wants you dead, the other half you owe money. Am I close? Lucky guess. That doesn't explain the ghost act. The people here hate me! But as the ghost, I could inspire the locals, rob the lowlifes, and... and... And buy your way to the mainland. Everybody wins! I should leave. Let you deal with this mess. Ah, but the ghost wouldn't do that, right? <sighs> Hold still. Uh, mm, arms are still asleep. Wake them up. I'll escort you to the campsite, but that's it. Ghost of Iki, you're on your own. Wait, wait, wait! You can't leave me here! Everyone on this island is out to get me! What about your recruit? You met Hugo. Is he alright? He nearly lost his head trying to pay your ransom. <sighs> He's just a fisherman. The kid needs me. Help me find Hugo, and I'll be out of your hair, I promise. Oh, he better be close. We agreed on a meeting place nearby. In case we were split up. Lead the way. I thought you only had eyes for Tsushima. What brings you to Iki? I came here with my father once. Years ago. Never thought I'd return. When I heard something terrible was happening here, I couldn't ignore it. Wish I'd known about those rumors. All I heard was Iki is safe. Not a Mongol in sight. This friend of yours, how did you convince him to join your ghost performance? The Eagle Tribe sank the boat I used to get here. I almost drowned, but Fugu pulled me from the sea. I tried to ditch him, but he wouldn't listen. He couldn't resist your charms. <laughs> Few can, my lord. Oh, 
It's me! I knew you'd escape, Master! The ghost lives to fight again! Hey, enough with the ghost, Hokugu. You can call me Kenji. My friend here is the ghost. Oh, I see. Well, someone called the Viper has a message for the ghost. Th that's for me. You're in trouble with the Viper of Hakata Bay? He's the smuggler I told you about. The one with the ship ready to sail for the mainland? I tried sneaking on board, but he caught me. Now I owe him a small fortune if I want to keep my head and get off this island. Then we better meet him and sort this out. You're going to help me? The ghost of Iki is going to help himself. I want to meet the smuggler who spent the last 20 years evading samurai capture. What happened to your horse? Nico? I had to trade him to the Viper as collateral. I hope he's all right. Lord Shimura's been hunting the Viper for years. You're lucky he didn't take one of your hands when you tried to sneak aboard his ship. He was about to chop off other things, but I convinced him to save me a seat to the mainland. All it took was handing over Miko and promising to pay ten times the asking price. You should know, the Viper doesn't like people like us. People like us? You know, tough guys. <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> Nothing. Well, whatever you do, don't push him. This doesn't have to get ugly. Wait here, Fugu. Yes, go. I mean, Master Kenji. Kenji, the ghost of Iki. We're here to see the Viper. Be calm, Kenji. And don't talk too much. Who? Me? Where is my money? You must be the Viper of Hakata Bay. Who is the muscle, Kenji? He's a friend. Jin Sakai. Sakai? Had a run-in with your father once. Never got the feeling back in my little finger. <laughs> Cannot say I mourned him. Keep disrespecting my father. Maybe I'll take the whole hand. Ta! <laughs> Jin, always with the jokes. I'm not laughing. How did this runt recruit a samurai? Kenji said he tried to sneak aboard your ship. He regrets the insult. That's me, stupid, disrespectful Kenji. Now he owes you a small fortune. A big fortune. If you came to negotiate, you are wasting my time. If you're holding out for money, it's going to take Kenji a year to pay you back. That is his problem. And yours. You need payment today to fund your journey. And whether the Mongol invasion lower Kenji's payment. And we can settle up now. Or wait and hope he survives long enough to pay you back in full. Hey! <sighs> you have got a smart friend, Kenji. I think we can work something out, Lord Sakai. Those Ego Tribe bastards stole my navigation charts. Maps of every smuggling route between China and Hakata Bay. You need them to reach the mainland. That is right. And if the Mongols break my code, they will learn every weakness in the Shogun's fleet. That sounds very bad. We can recover these charts. If you grant Kenji passage to the mainland. You have yourself a deal. Keep an eye on Kenji. Trouble sticks to him like shit on rice. Could have gone worse. The Viper trusts us. 
Now we have to deliver. I think I pulled something when those bandits tied me up. Maybe I should rest up while Hugel helps you rob the Mongols. He's just a fisherman, Kenji. He saved your life. I know. If you want to act like a ghost, stop using people and start thinking how you can help them. Back there with the Viper. You had me scared for a moment. I told you he hates the tough act. Some people respond only to kindness. Others require a glimpse of steel. The Viper needed to remember what it meant to deal with a samurai. Well, I'm glad you kept it under control. You don't want to see him on a bad day. More guards than I expected. Maybe I should keep watch. Anything goes wrong, I'll give a signal. Bird call. No! Screaming monkey! Shh! Viper's navigation charts. Time to go.
Any luck? I've got it. Let's go. The fight took a lot out of me. Just in time. Good work. Everything is here. We'll just need a few minutes to check my maps. Then we set sail. What about the people we sent ahead of us? Settled on board, but we are at capacity. Have to dump all expendable cargo. There's only room for one more passenger. Ready to set sail, Kenji? When do we leave? Soon. We wait for no one. Reza doing business with you. Lord Sakai. And you. Sure you don't want in? I could hide you in one of my sake barrels. It's a tight squeeze, but with a little cooking oil, those narrow hips... Uh... <laughs> I'll pass. I'm not finished here yet. Well... I guess this is goodbye. Keep some of your best sake chill for me. We'll celebrate when this is all over. I'd like that. Forget something, Master? Yeah, my common sense. <sighs> Take my seat on the ship. You earned it. But, Master... Get moving, before I change my mind. I didn't think you had it in you. I'll scrape by. Fugu, I didn't like his chances. It's better this way. Besides, you didn't think you'd get rid of me that easily, did you? I'm not that lucky. This calls for a drink. To the ghost of Iki. To forgetting all about him. wrong to shed blood here. It's so peaceful. did this. She lured me away from study and practice with the promise of pears or dried melons, then lied to my father and said we'd studied all afternoon. She told me sometimes living is more important.